Hey guys, my name is Ryan. And my name is Miska. And welcome to Overwatch Central. So, a new patch has hit the PTR and will go live on the normal client within two weeks most likely. But not all of the issues were addressed in this patch of course. One of these recurring topics when discussing how to improve Overwatch from a development standpoint is the spectator system. Currently, it's a decent system, but there are improvements that can be made to it. Just last week, the ESL Atlantic Showdown happened. Over 70,000 people watched it on Twitch, and overall, it was a pretty good success. But if you're new to competitive Overwatch, or even Overwatch as a whole, it can be really difficult to follow. Most potential spectator system improvements lie in amount of information on screen at once. Currently, we have the heroes on both teams, their health bars, an ultimate charge, as well as the kill feed. The rest is just the camera being manually moved around. There's a lot of things that could be added to the heads up display and UI in general to convey more information and also sum up the match as a whole. Fight recaps of some kind would be fantastic for example, so after a big fight is over you could possibly be able to check which heroes died in that last fight and which of them used their ultimates and so on. Or even better create graphs, one of which could be showing payload progress when it was stopped, contested and so on to visualize the back and forth struggle that an overwatch match can very well be. Around the time that Lucio Ball and the Summer Games were announced, there was a developer livestream on the Fairlight Excalibur's channel. Kaplan was on it and talked about the spectator system for Overwatch in connection with esports. He said we want to work on more spectator mode features, in particular for esports. And when we do more for esports, we want to add a spectator mode to add a lot more statistics for the match, so the broadcasters and observers can surface more to the viewers, and I think it would make a really good experience for viewing esports or competitive Overwatch. And this is really good to hear. Even simple statistics such as bringing up damage blocks from the tanks mid-game, damage dealt by damage heroes and other general hero specific stats would be great to see. Another thing that isn't as high up on the list is adding more heads up display and observation tools that wouldn't just be based around basic stats. Right now we have the typical setup of being able to spectate a player in third or first person as well as manually move the camera around. But imagine adding a top down minimap for example with all the characters on it in the top left corner or something. This would give you a much better idea of the battlefield and the match as a whole as it is happening. Anyway another feature that could be added is possibly the ability to spectate an observer. What I mean by this is that they should add the ability to be able to follow an observer as a caster. This makes online tournaments a lot easier to handle as you only need one observer and all the casters can just follow along without having to move the camera around. So they can choose to spectate the observer if they don't want to touch the camera controls at all. Or they could manually control if they want to get another angle of a fight or something like that. In connection with all this, supporting esports for Overwatch doesn't just have to mean a spectator system in itself. Setting up competitive matches and displaying the current series score in the top would also help. If two teams are playing a series, then that could be simply be set up in the lobby to be displayed mid-match. Allowing the overlay to stay clean and consistent. Exploring the idea of an in-game tournament system would also be amazing, and is something we've briefly talked about before, but that's a whole nother topic in itself, honestly. Anyway, we're pretty much done here, please comment on our ideas in the comments below and also make sure to let us know if you've watched and enjoyed the ESL Atlantic showdown this weekend. We got Ely coming up with the Overwatch Open in not too long, so make sure to check that out too. I doubt we'll have any new spectator tools by then, but regardless, it's worth keeping up to date with. Links to everything we've discussed will be available in the description below. And that's it for this video, thank you very much for watching, please do make sure to drop a like if you enjoyed the video, subscribe for more Overwatch content if you haven't already, and until next time, take care, we'll see you then.